have arrived to Miami. My ears are still freaking, what's that thing called? Miami? Yeah. Oh. So I'm gonna show you guys the hotel room really quickly before we go out to eat because we're starving. All right, so when you walk in, there's a little mirror right here, a little closet area, the bathroom, standard hotel bathroom. I like the decor. Uh -huh. Place to put our clothes for the next few days. This is the sliding door I'm locking you in. Hey. Oh, nice. Doorway, I like that. It's a nice design. And then you enter the room. The big room. A little nice stand table, a little art. The king size bed. Freaking huge. I like that. The art. Oh, I didn't even see that though. It's really nice. Nice stand, a little sofa, desk with another mirror. Come Love that. The TV, more dresser space, a random male. <laughs> and then the view. The city view. It is so nice outside. It's so pretty. They have like a. I <laughs> really blowing your nose right now. Sorry, I need to blow my nose. <laughs> now we're just gonna go find some food to eat at the restaurant, the hotel, and then probably check out the pool afterwards. But we need food first, so that's what we're gonna do for now. God, the lighting in this room sucks right now. But it is currently 8.57 at night out. And we just got back from walking around a little bit and eating at the restaurant. We wanted to go chill at the pool, but their pool closes at dusk. So I guess we'll hit that up tomorrow morning. Right now we're relaxing. My wisdom tooth is really killing me, you guys. It freaking hurts so much. I have an appointment next Monday to take it out and I cannot wait to get rid of it. Just take it out of my mouth. I think we're just gonna call it a night. We got to Miami pretty late in the afternoon, like 5.30. We got to the hotel. We checked in, which took a little bit longer than anticipated. We went out to eat and then I didn't really vlog at the restaurant because it was outdoors and there's quite a bit of people and I feel like our waiter as well was kind of overwhelmed so it took a long time to get our food, it took a long time to check out so but I kind of put a damper on our night because everything else was pushed back but that's okay. I'm just so happy we got to Miami safe and sound and honestly I cannot wait to just shower and relax like the flight took a lot out of us and we kind of just want to relax for the first night and then pick it up early tomorrow. Uh, but for now, I'm just going to call it a night and I'll see you guys in the morning. <laughs> the next day it's a beautiful day out we're gonna get like so tan today i'm so excited this pale guy right here is gonna get tan as well so i'll walk the beach i feel like i still have my morning voice on but we're gonna walk the beach what's wrong leave me alone <laughs> go away <laughs> we're gonna walk the beach and then find breakfast and then i don't know we might go biking later depends on what we find to do 
I have like a really simple outfit on right now. This is just a black tube top from my garage haul and some biker shorts from Aritzia to walk the beach with some flip flops and calling it a day. And then when we finish walking the beach and eating breakfast, we'll come back up and I'll change. We'll probably head to the pool as well. So I don't know, a lot going on. Today's our first full day in Miami. So I'm excited. We're gonna have fun. It's gonna be some good stuff. My lip gloss was even on correctly. back from the pool and from walking the beach and we have some smoothies as you guys saw it was so freaking good a plus for that and now we just are back in our room to shower wash off all the chlorine from the pool get dressed and get ready to go back out and do a little bit of exploring i don't know if you guys can hear the shower in the background but yeah, I'm wearing the bathing suit I got from Zaful. If you guys saw my Zaful haul, if not, I'll link it below. I got so many cute pieces from there, and I brought a bunch for this trip. So definitely make sure that you go check that out. I can show you a little bit of it right now. Walk to the mirror. This is what it looks like, and I'm just wearing some tie-dye shorts, but I have the bathing suit on the bottom. And yeah, I feel like I got dark already. I don't know if you guys can tell. Oh yeah, you guys can tell. I got dark already. Look at that. Honestly, guys, I thought that we were gonna have a harder time of like finding things that are open. If you look at it, walk out naked. <laughs> I thought we were gonna have a harder time of like finding things that were open or like not a lot of people are gonna be here. But there's quite a bit of people here. Obviously, we're still practicing like social distancing. We're still wearing our masks when we're out in public. So we're being as safe as possible and we have a bunch of hand sanitizer with us and everywhere we've been, like the restaurants have social distancing tables and even downstairs in the pool area, like everyone's social distancing. I feel like everyone has been social distancing even before everything happened. Like at least us as a couple, we've always liked to have our privacy and have stayed away from crowds. That's just how we roll. So I don't know. Even though it's a new normal, it's kind of something that we're used to. But I'm glad we were able to escape even for a few days just to get some sun, relax, and bring you guys along so you guys can live vicariously through us if you're not able to travel yet. You get to enjoy Miami with us. Yeah, I, mean, I like the vibe of Miami. It reminds me so much of Puerto Rico where my family's from with still having that city vibe that I love from Boston. Let me stop rambling. I gotta go pick out my outfit that I'm gonna wear, hit the shower, and then go out exploring. And I'm gonna bring you guys along with me. So, can't wait for that. All showered and ready to go. Just wearing a maxi. No, it's not a maxi, a midi dress. Hey! 
a mini dress from Zara with some white sneakers just to be comfortable when we walk. And this dress is so comfortable, so happy I brought it. And now we're gonna go walk around to see what we find. Hola, mamacito. Are you having fun? Da, da, da. No. Why not? The worst time of my life. Mm, you're having the best time of your life. I don't think so. I think so. The worst time. I should be playing Fallout. Yeah. Honestly. Video games? No. Hashtag Fallout. Look at this blue. Look at this view. Do, do, do. You ready to go walk and explore? Mm, 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 mm. I'm gonna go to the club. <laughs> Cl oh, <laughs> Clothes are an open. <laughs> I'm gonna go, go club anyways. Alright, let's go. So good. Vegetable sandwich. Shrimp taco. Oh my god, we're definitely biking this whole beach. This whole thing. It's gonna be a long day. Come on, we'll bike. That's fine. I like biking. Yeah. Look who got sunburnt. Stop catches. <laughs> Oh, yeah, some people are conscious. Look, we got sunburned. No, I just Let hit me myself. see the other one. I fell on the street. Did you see me? <laughs> we just walked all of Ocean Park. And now we're gonna go get some water at CVS because I think I'm a little dehydrated. And. A little? A little. And then head back to the pool. <laughs> Third outfit of the day. We're going out to dinner. So I'm wearing this Floyd dress with some black flip-flops and on a mission to find something to eat. What are you doing? You look like a clown. I'm out of luck. I'm visible. I need to see a guy with an American flag. You're not invisible. Oh my god. So, dinner time. What up? You're so military. Look how you're standing. <sighs> this is such an army man. Hello, I am. I got my bear. I got some red news. I know. I got a sunburn. <laughs> okay, let's go, girl. Let's put some bread. You got a lot of bread in there? <laughs> oh my god. Ah, uh, the sunset's coming. We should go over there, find a place where we can see the sunset. I think it'll be closed. This thing closed in 30 minutes. The beach closes at 8 too, right? Hey guys, it's currently 9.12 at night and we just got back to the room after having like a couple glasses of wine and just chilling outdoors. It was so relaxing and so much fun. I'm glad we were able to do that. And now we're just back in the room and we're going to shower. My husband's in the shower. I don't know if you hear him in the background. I think we're going to call it a night. My hair's a mess. I literally have water and beach hair, whatever you want to call this. I don't know. But this pretty much concludes day two of Miami Beach. We had so much fun today. We literally... I feel like we did a lot, but again, I feel like we didn't do a lot. We started off the day by walking the beach, we went to the pool, then we came back, changed, had coffee, had a muffin, and then we went back out to the pool, relaxed for a little bit more. We walked Ocean Park, had lunch at Ocean Park, then walked back and was chilling at the pool again, and then we went back to ocean drive for dinner 
walked around and did the night with like an two glasses of wine at the hotel it was a chill day something that i really needed and i'll see you guys in day two if you are new here please subscribe i would love to have you on my channel please give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys in day three of miami